Hi friends, welcome back to Taylor Sydney's Yoga and Fitness. My name is Taylor and this is your week two kids yoga class. So let's get right into it. We are starting our yoga class off today in child's pose. So you'll make your way to your hands and your knees. Draw your big toes to touch, knees go wide as your mat. I love to use the support of a block underneath my hips just to give my knees a little bit of support so you can place a block there too if it feels good to you or you can bring a block underneath your forehead if that feels good to you when you make it to your child's pose start to walk your hands forward bring your forehead to rest onto your mat now really stretch through your fingertips Push into the palms of your hands so that your elbows will lift off of your mat. Let's start with our breath. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Fill up your belly. Expand your rib cage. And then open mouth. Exhale. Let that go slowly. Two more just like that. Inhale. Fill up your belly. Feel your rib cage get big. And exhale, let that go. One more cleansing breath. Inhale through your nose. Fill up your belly. Reach your fingertips a little bit longer. And open mouth. Exhale, let that go. Good job, friends. Inhale, push up to your tabletop pose. So push up to all fours. Stack your shoulders over your wrists and your hips over your knees. Then exhale. Now inhale for dolphin. Walk your hands forward, drop your hips. Look up to the ceiling, reach your toes towards your head. And exhale, child's pose. All the way back. Hips come to rest onto your heels. Forehead is down. Let's do that again. Inhale, dolphin pose. Push your hips forward. Look up to the ceiling. Toes reach to your head. Exhale, child's pose. Hips to your heels forehead down one more time inhale dolphin pose toes to your head look up to the ceiling open your chest exhale cat hips to your heels reach your fingers long then come back to your tabletop position Gaze down at your mat and really push through your hands so you have strong arms here. Tuck your toes, come to the balls of your feet. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, hovering tabletop. Lift your knees a couple inches off of your mat. Push through the palms of your hands. Really nice job, friends. Hold this really strong for four. Downward facing dog in three, you've got this, two, and one, downward facing dog, lift your hips up and back, and take your dog for a little walk here, so pedal out your feet, drop one foot, and then the other, stretch out the backs of your legs. Then inhale, rise up to your tippy toes. And exhale, release your heels into your mat. Let's do that again. Inhale, rise to your tippy toes. And exhale, release your heels into your mat. So friends, really press through your fingertips. Then press your belly towards your thighs and heels relax down the floor 
So inhale, look to your hands. And exhale on your tippy toes. Walk your feet to behind your hands. Feet are separated. Bend your knees to allow your belly to relax onto your thighs. Let's take a couple of shakes of our head. Yes. Shake your head. Yes. Then shake your head, no, say no. Do that again, shake your head, yes, say yes. And shake your head, no, say no. Let your head hang heavy. And repeat after me, say, I am calm. I am calm. Bend your knees, friends. Roll up so slow. Let your head be the last to reach your standing position. Nice job, friends. Now take a couple of shoulder rolls here. Roll your shoulders backwards. Then roll your shoulders forward. And then find stillness. Let your palms face the front of your room. And then spark your fingertips. Have so much energy in the palms of your hands. Hold your belly muscles strong. And stand up tall and proud. Then say, I am confident. I am confident. Inhale, mountain pose. Sweep both fingertips up towards the ceiling. Breathe here. So reach through your fingertips. Stand up as tall as a big tree. Inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Hinge at your torso. Start to release your hands and the crown of your head to your mat. Now inhale, half lift. Plant your palms against your shins. Find a flat, strong back here. Shift the weight into your toes. Inhale. Exhale, high plank. Plant your hands, find your plank, friends. So strong here. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, downward dog. Make a V-shape in your body. Let's flow this a little bit faster. One breath to one movement. Inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, walk your feet to your hands. Inhale, half lift. Find a flat back here. Exhale, forward fold. Release it all the way down. Inhale, mountain. Stand up tall. Exhale, forward fold. Hinge at your torso. Release your hands towards your mat. Inhale, half lift. Flatten your back. Exhale, high plank. Plant your hands, step your feet back, feel so strong. Deep breath in, exhale, downward facing dog. One more time, friends, inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, on your tippy toes, walk your feet to behind your wrist. Inhale, half lift, find a flat back here. Exhale, forward fold. Release it down. Now inhale, mountain pose. Ground down to stand up so tall. Exhale, forward fold. Hinge at your torso. Release your hands down towards your mat. Inhale, half lift. Hold your belly muscles strong. Find a flat back. Exhale, high plank. 
Plant your hands, step your feet back. You are so strong and powerful. Inhale, exhale, downward facing dog. Lift your hips. Take a deep breath in through your nose, friends. And open mouth, exhale, blow it out. <sighs> Lower down to your knees. Come to your tabletop position. Let's work our belly muscles here so we can activate our strong muscles. We'll move into our balancing stick, friends. So reach your right arm out in front of you. Your thumb faces up like you're giving someone a handshake. Now you reach your opposite leg, so your left leg behind you. Hold this really strong. You've got this. For three. Back to your tabletop pose in two. And one. Tabletop pose. Come back to your hands and knees. Now this time, you reach your left arm out long. Thumb faces up like you're giving someone a handshake. And your opposite leg. So your right leg reaches behind you. No worries if you fall down, friends. You just go right back at it. You keep trying. Pull this for three, for two, and one. Good job, friends. Let's try that one more time. Reach your right arm out long, thumb faces up like you're giving someone that handshake. Extend your left leg behind you. Hold your belly muscles strong. If you come down, if you fall out, it is all good. You just go right back into it. You keep challenging yourself. Hold this for three. Tabletop pose in two. And one. Tabletop pose hands and knees. Switch your hands, reach your left arm out long. Extend your right leg behind you. Hold your belly muscles so, so strong. Hold this for three. Back to your tabletop pose in two. And one. Tabletop pose. Good job, friends. Take a deep breath in. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. All right, take a seat on your mat. We'll move into our boat pose. So flex your toes towards the ceiling. Your heels are attached to your mat. Reach your fingertips out long. Take a deep breath in. And then lower your back halfway. Good job, friends. Shoulders down your back. Now hold this position strong. Extend your right leg long. Straighten your knee. Hold this for three. You'll switch your legs in two. And one. Right leg down. Stretch your left leg long. Flex your toes. Hold this for three. For two. And one, tap it back down. Let's do that again. Right leg kicks out long to the ceiling. Hold this strong for three, for two, and one. Tap it back down. Now your left leg, stretch your left leg long. Hold it out here for three. Can you lift it higher? Two, and one. Good job, friends. Come to your Sukhasana or your crisscross applesauce. Hands rest on your knees. Close your eyes here, just for a little bit. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Big open mouth exhale, let it go. <sighs> Try another one. Deep breath in, fill up your belly. 
and big belly open mouth exhale good job friends gently blink your eyes open come back to your tabletop pose to your hands and to your knees then make your way to your downward facing dog tuck your toes and lift your hips up and back find that V shape a deep breath in here and a big open mouth exhale let it go now inhale look to your hands and exhale travel to your hands walk your feet to behind your wrist inhale half lift find that flat back again exhale forward fold release it down now listen here friends inhale chair pose seat low like you're sitting in a chair reach your arms above you breathe here now put more weight into your heels friends than you do your toes you should actually be able to look down and see your little toes and then can you move your toes around and place them back down. Good job. Hold your belly muscles really strong here. Inhale. Exhale, bring your hands together at your heart center. Stay low in your legs. Really use your strong leg muscles. Take a deep breath in here. We've got a big transition coming up, friends. Exhale, crescent lunge. Just step your left leg to the mat behind you. Reach your fingertips to the ceiling above you. Really nice work. Big balancing challenge coming up here. Inhale, exhale airplane pose launch your left leg in the air and then reach your fingertips to the wall behind you stay strong on your right leg see if you can look at just one spot in your room this will help you balance Focus your eyes, that's called a drishti. Can you say, I am balanced? I am balanced. Good job, friends. Let's come back to our crescent lunge. Tap your left foot down. Fingertips reach to the ceiling. Inhale. Exhale, warrior two. Open to the side of your mat. Widen your stance. Bend in your front knee. Straighten your back leg. Your back foot should be flat on the mat. Gaze over your front hand. Know that you are so strong and so powerful. Inhale, peaceful warrior. Reach your top hand high, but keep the bend in your front leg. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, plank pose. Plant your hands onto your mat. Make your body in one straight line. Then downward facing dog. Really nice job, friends. Let's do it on the other side. Inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, walk your feet to behind your wrist on your tippy toes. Inhale, half lift. Find a flat back here. Exhale, forward fold. Release it down. Now inhale, chair pose. Back to our chair pose. Reach your fingertips above you. Remember, you should be able to see your toes and 
wiggle your toes around. Sit a little bit lower in your leg spread, that's it. Inhale, exhale, move your hands to heart center. Good job. This time it's your right foot that taps back. Inhale, crescent lunge. Right foot taps back. Fingertips reach to the ceiling above you. That big balance challenge is coming up. Airplane pose. Launch your right foot into the air. Extend your fingers behind you. Good job, focus your eyes. Remember to look at just one spot in your room that will help you balance. That is called a drishti. Can you say, I am balanced? No worries if you fall out of it, you go right back into it. That's why it's a practice, friends. I am balanced. Good job, come back to your crescent lunge. Tap your right foot back, reach your fingertips above you. Inhale. Exhale, warrior two. Wide into the long edge side of your mat. Bend your front leg, straighten your back leg. Look over your front hand. Inhale, reverse, rather peaceful warrior. Sweep your left hand high. But keep the bend in your front knee. Relax your left shoulder down. Inhale. Exhale, plank pose. Find that straight line in your body. Feel so strong here, friends. Inhale. Exhale, downward dog. Make a V shape with your body. Really good job. Come down to your knees and take a seat. We'll start to slow it down. Legs reach out long in front of you. Flex your feet up towards the ceiling. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, seated forward full. Reach for your feet. But remember friends, you can bend your knees as much as you need to so that you can actually grab your feet. Let's take a few deep breaths here. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. One more deep breath in. One more exhale, let it go. Good job, friends. Roll up through your back. And then Lower all the way down till you're laying flat on your back. Hug your knees into your chest. Then a happy baby pose. So knees come to your armpits. Stamp your footprint onto the ceiling. You can grab for your feet here or your ankles or the backs of your knees. Most important that your lower back stay attached to the mat. Take little rocks from side to side. Good job, friends. Hug your knees to your chest. Give yourself a really tight hug. Connect your forehead to your knees. Take in one more deep breath of air. And exhale, Shavasana. Take your rest, friends. Let your legs stretch out long. Feet flop out to the side. Close your eyes and rest. Try to keep your body so, so still. 
and maybe you just focus on your breath. On your inhales and on your exhale. You rest here, friends. I will let you know when it's time to come out of your Shavasana. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Exhale, let it go. Bring some wiggles into your fingers and to your toes. Take some ankle circles and wrist circles. Then reach your arms above your head for a good morning stretch. Reach through your fingers, point through your toes. And then curl into a little tiny ball into either side of your neck. Pause here for just a moment, friends. Come back to sitting up tall in your Sukhasana or your crisscross applesauce. Hands come to your knees. Close your eyes. Let's close out with breathing together. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. Bring your hands together at your heart center, deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. One more inhale. Exhale, we'll bow forward in mutual gratitude. Thank you so much, friends, for your time, your energy, your effort, and your trust. Come back to sitting up tall. Release your hands to your knees. Gently blink your eyes open. Really nice practice today. I can't wait to see you next time on your mat. Have an amazing rest of your day.